Hey guys, Penny Turco here from PennyTurco.com. I wanted to share this video with you today because it seems like so much anytime now folks that um, have engaged in really monetizing social media and have gotten onto Facebook to promote their businesses, grow their personal brand, generate traffic and customers and sales are finding it very difficult to find an application whereby they can easily put whatever they want onto their, their Facebook tabs. Because our Facebook fan pages work so much like our own website or business sales site they're so very functional and it doesn't have to be as difficult as some think it might be so what I wanted to do uh, today in this video this quick little video is share with you this application that I found that is absolutely fantastic and it's so absolutely versatile you can do anything with it so here we are on my Facebook fan page I just want to show you first of all what, what a tab looks like that I've created uh, with this app um, the app is called short stack and you can find it actually right on Facebook if you uh, do a search here in your search function um, and it'll pop up. The app will pop up and you can add it. But what will happen is you'll actually be sent to their website and it's on their actually external website where you create your uh, tab app and you can publish it there and it will go directly onto your Facebook tab. So I just want to show you what it looks like. Sorry, it's taking a few minutes to load here or a few seconds. Um, but it's really great. Uh, actually, you know what? This is the wrong one. Let me just go back here. Here's the one that I created with it. So, the nice thing about this application, the short stack application is that there are so many different templates you can use and you know how when you hear it's drag and drop easily easy and you think oh yeah and you get there and it's really not <laughs> drag and drop easy this absolutely is uh, phenomenal you can and I'm going to take you over to the website just so you can see how simple it is but you can add pictures if you want you can add, add text um, you can add uh, your, even your SoundCloud um, your SoundCloud platform. If you're a SoundCloud member, you can actually add your SoundCloud. So here's some of the calls that I've done. Um, you can add web forms, but that's not all. There are so many different things that you can add. Okay, um, you. This is a free application. You don't pay anything for it. It's absolutely free, um, but it will have this little logo on the bottom. Once you reach 10,000 fans, it's no longer free, but it's very, very affordable. Um, and you can change things uh, about um, in it. I mean, you usually won't see this, but, but I'm because I'm the page admin. I'll see all of this stuff at the bottom of my tab. So if you were visiting this, uh, which you might, uh, on my fan page, you won't see any of this. Okay, so I'm just going to take you over here now to the actual application to the window. So you see here, short, shortstack.com. And I've already got an, uh, uh, an account here, but you can sign up easily. Log in here. And what you have to do first, of course, like I said, is you have to search it in Facebook and then add the add the tab application. So here you can see um, the tabs that I've already created and you can go in and you can uh, edit them if you wish. I just wanted to show you what they what they look like and how simple it is. All right. So first of all, um, there's many different uh, templates that you can choose from. So you can see they've got, um, this is a new one that they just did for the fall coming on with football. They have a football pole template. Um, I guess the score template, that's another foot one, football one they've done for the fall. But a fan reveal promotion template. And look at all of these. There's a, whoops, sorry. 
There's a Pinterest template. There's a coupon, a uh, simple left column template, a sweepstakes, contact us. So it just shows where you are, and you can have people enter their details, a uh, photo promotion. And then these are just sort of standard generic ones that just have columns, and then you put whatever you want in. And that's what I used. I used a simple two-column um, template right here to make that tab I showed you. Three-column photo vote contest, four column, left and two. I mean, there's so many, right? There's so many that you can use. A like drive template. So this will drive likes to your to your tab. And I'm going to play around with some of these. I haven't had time to make a whole bunch of them, but oh man, there, there's so much functionality to this application. And it's so absolutely very simple. So that's just the first page. There's two more. I think there's 67 templates that you can use, right? And so I'm just going to go back now. I just want to show you um, how I created the tab that I showed you. So this is the actual tab that I showed you. You'll recognize that. Okay. And you'll see it's got my SoundCloud account in there so I can play my audios right in my fan page tab. Isn't that cool? So what you do basically is when you start out, this is empty. This is just the two up um, template, the two, the two sided, right and left. And then what you do is you look at all of the widgets, and it shows you how to go about doing it. And there are videos here too when you start in the back that um, take you through step by step on how to do it. But it says, okay, left start. This is your left column. And what I've done here in the left column is I put text, text, text. I put three or four different text. Okay. And then you can do your right side. In your right side, I put, um, whoops, where am I? Right side, I put an image, and then I put more text, and then I put my SoundCloud widget, and then I put a like widget from Facebook, and then that was the end. And then there's a bottom layout. I put also, um, I made my form um, two out of text. Okay, so so cool. So what I want to show you here is let's just go through some of what these widgets are. They're fantastic. So uh, promotional tools, okay. Uh, this is an image widget. This is the WYSIWYG uh, uh, rich text is, uh, uh, image, okay. And this is where you can link. You can link uh, to other outside outside URLs. Gallery, so you can have a display or a whole bunch of gallery of images. You can have a shopping cart on here. Okay, for products, a comments widget, like button, a friend invite, and then of course they have one for their very own custom forms that you can use. Of course, I use Aweber forms, so that's what I did. I did an Aweber one, but you can do a contract, a contact entry uh, widget, newsletter sign up. So if you want people to subscribe to your newsletter, and then you can in integrate stuff like a video widget. Twitter you can integrate, um, your RRS feed, and then here's the SoundCloud that I used. That's a widget, so simple to use. Uh, Flickr for your photos, uh, Foursquare widget. What else do we have here? Oh my gosh, there's just so much, right? iFrame, it's got everything. Here it's got the Google Maps widget, it's so cool, so that's where you can do a contact form. Um, which one is this? This one is Foursquare, yeah. And again, a newsletter. Toy box, a virtual gift widget. So let your visitors send virtual gifts to their friends off of your fan page. Very cool. A poll and a countdown. So then these are advanced widgets here. I haven't tried any of these yet uh, for a flash movie. But so cool. So you just, what you do is you just, um, you have the layout, right? And you drag and drop drag and drop and it will create these what's ever in these two columns whatever you drag and then you open so here's the rich test rich text widget for my left hand column if i open it up you'll see the content that i put in okay in here oh, i don't know why that's not showing up Maybe it's just taking a little while. But anyway, it's just like a regular WYSIWYG. You just add it, and then you save it, and there it is. It goes into your, it goes right in here. And then once you're done placing everything, like as you as you put everything in here, okay, your your 
so here's the SoundCloud. Just let me show you what this looks like. So it just asks you for your SoundCloud um, URL for your personal SoundCloud account. You put it in, you hit save, and that'll pop up in that widget. Very cool. So once you're all done, uh, you would scroll up to the top, and there's usually right here a button that says once you change it, this button will say publish. You click on that publish button, and it publishes it right to your fan page. So how cool is that? I mean, it's so, so very easy. Um, I want to actually show you, let's just go back here. I want to actually show you where you would go. So just stick in here, short stack. Okay, and there's the app. It's got the pancakes. <laughs> it's a short stack of pancakes. Okay, and you right here you would say visit app website. And it'll ask you to log in and try it for free. Okay, and you do that. Try it for free. You'll add the app to your Facebook, and then you go in to the actual uh, website at shortstack.com, and it'll direct you there, and you can create uh, your very first tab. And there are a huge number of tabs that you can create there. You're not limited. But again, it's free until you have 2,000 fans. Okay? And then after that, there's a small monthly fee for it. But I wanted to share it with you because um, I just I couldn't believe how simple it was to make. It took just minutes to make. And um, in fact, it was... Uh, I'm just going to go back. Uh, very, very versatile. I hadn't seen, actually hadn't seen any other um, tabs before that actually has the SoundCloud, the SoundCloud uh, app right installed onto one of the tabs. So I just wanted to show you. So there's my fan page. There's my Wake Up to Success Call tab for Network Marketing VT. And again, there it is. So you can you can make it whatever you want, and of course the big the big part of it that's really great is that you can put your you can put a, a web form in there that's atta attached to your Aweber too just by using the HTML uh, on the WYSIWYG text editor. So anyway, guys, I just wanted to share that with you. That's my quick video for today. So at shortstack.com, go and check it out. And if you like this video, be sure to share it with your friends. Click the big thumbs up and like the video. Leave comments on this app and let me know what your experience is. And maybe even share some of the URLs to some of your tabs so that people can see how versatile this application is and what you can actually do with it. Um, and be sure to contact me if you want to get to know more about me. And um, if you want to work with me and get some social media coaching and training, be sure to drop by my fan page at facebook.com slash pennyturklefanpage and uh, check out my social media tip of the day. All right. So that's it. Uh, I wanted to say thank you for joining me here today. And again, visit me over here at my fan page at uh, facebook.com. Can I turn the fan page? Thanks, guys. Bye for now.